Hey guys, there's another f uh, video about the uh, Sony Remote Play feature uh, and installation on any Android device. Uh, I made another video about this already, but that was a little bit too complicated for some people. So I'll make another video with another way easier method to install this uh, application. I will be using my Nexus 5 uh, and I received some questions about the Nexus 5 and uh, the fact that you guys weren't able to uh, copy the files. Uh, with this method you only need a custom recovery installed and you need roots to, in order to do that. So look up tutorials how to do this and then follow um, this tutorial to install Remote Play on your device. So uh, remove all files. I have uh, two files, or ex actually one file, um, uh, one zip file. Uh, extract it and put it on your device. You will get a remote. Uh, uh, what was it? Let me check. Remote play installer and the com dot playstation dot remote dot apk file, uh, and copy these both to the root of your SD card. Now. Uh, the thing you do is you enter your, um, you shut down your device. You enter your recovery, recovery mode. So let us start. Install. Find the zip, you should find um, Remote Play Installer. I hope you can see it. Remote Play Installer. Install that file. Yes, swipe to confirm. Installation is complete. Now just reboot your system. Oh. This is basically everything you have to do actually. There's a one other step and then you can use all features of the PlayStation M. Um, yeah, just let's wait for this. Okay, enter your pin if you have one. So I will do this now. Now uh, go to any uh, installer, any um, file explore, explorer and install the remote play app. The APK. You have to do this after every reboot of the phone. It will not, or the, the app will not work if you um, if you do not do this. Uh, Play Store. Now find the PlayStation app. The PlayStation app, download the PlayStation app. Okay, after you've done that, uh, you should go to Root Clock again. Uh, let me find it. Uh, which is the exposed module you we also use in the other tutorial so install that uh, using exposed uh, remove apps uh, and add the apps uh, find the playstation app there's two there's one for remote play and the other one is for the app itself so let me let me look mm -mm -mm. PlayStation app, another one which is, I believe it's called Remote Play. Um, yeah, Remote Play. Now you've added them both, you can just launch the PlayStation app now. This will start. Um, make sure that you're on, a, on the same Wi-Fi network, which I'm not currently, so it doesn't fight my PlayStation. 
Now, now I'm logged into my network. So it's searching for my PlayStation with as you can see it's on. PlayStation 4 remote play. Next. It's searching. The PlayStation has detected the app already. And there you go, you have remote play. So I hope this helps. You can find the files in the description of this video. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them. Thank you. Bye.